and in our bid to support the less privileged and the downtrodden in the society by putting on a smile and restoring their hope and confidence during the Yuletide seasons. Methodist Church Nigeria Kaduna Diocese has distributed food and non-food items, clothing to widows, orphans and persons living with disabilities to give them a sense of belonging in the society in Kaduna State, Northwest Nigeria. Plus TV News correspondent Habila Derefe reports. The Christian community outreach in this Yuletide season is to reach out to hundreds of vulnerable persons, both Christians, Muslims, and less privileged in the society. This initiative is part of their corporate social responsibility to the masses. They visited correctional centers, persons living with disabilities and aged parents on the street to encourage and give them hope in this economic hardship. The Archbishop of the Church, Reverend Joseph Nona, says Nigerians and wealthy individuals must imbibe the habit of extending love and support to the vulnerable people in the society. He added that the less privileged feel aggrieved because of the gap between the rich and the poor, leading to an increased rate of crime, communal crisis without cause, hence the need to support them. And then there are people who may not have that opportunity to celebrate. That's the thing that prompted us to begin to think of, give these people a sense of belonging. So they can also know that the Christmas is not just for a separated set of people. Um, they are going to get the raw rice, they are going to eat the cooked one. The raw one is for them to take home. And then uh, it's such a quantity that will also help them eat for today and tomorrow and perhaps even for that Christmas day. And that's the reason why there's the yam in addition to it. So this uh, bit of the arrangement we are making to give a sense of belonging to some people within the society. It's not always very easy. The people are people that are suffering. People we voted for. We voted for them to go and then serve us. But now they have taken authority and they are doing things as they like. They don't even want to care what the people are going through. Also, the Senior Secretary of Methodist Church Nigeria, Cardinal Diocese, Reverend Abel Amuta says the support cuts across all, irrespective of religious background and ethnicity. This is about bringing support to people. So at this point in time, if we are opportune, people from outside the church, people who are entirely not, who does not have any connection with our church, were also picked. So we ask our churches uh, in their environment, they should try and identify some people who are in need. Even from the outside here, we had people whom we just went to the street and, and asked them to come and partake of this thing. We had people from other faiths, not necessarily even Christians, as I said, whom we are reaching out to today. All believers, Christians, churches can, should make effort to do the same. And we will see the happiness in the entire society. Because surely there are so many people today who will go back home and say, yes, I now have a cup of rice here, I have a little meat for my Christmas. And advise people to show one another love, just love, irrespective of faith, creeds. Let's just give out love to one another. However, the leader of persons living with disabilities and some other persons who benefited from the gesture expressed delight, saying such will go a long way to support them while calling on all Nigerians to do same by making the society a better place for all. I'm happy. I don't know that this day will be like this today for me. Blessed with fools that I will go and eat with my children. It helped me plenty. It helped me to, to feed myself and my children. I know that this food, when I eat it, it will nourish my body and the body of my children. Because I know that this food comes from God. It is God that the one that brought this food. I said, may God bless this, this cathedral, this church. And as I'm here this morning, uh, I never expected it. Glory be to God for the things I've been given and I've been received, both in prayer and uh, in material things. It's going to help me a lot because the prayer that I prayed yesterday, as I said earlier, it was because of my problem. But God has been answering it in the way I didn't expect. Bless the church. May God bless the people who have made up their mind that this thing will reach at me.
The church insists on continuing to support the vulnerable, less privileged, orphans and widows by giving them a sense of belonging in the society. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.